Good morning. So we, uh, this is day four, I think, since getting here. Um, yesterday we had some guests over, Tony's girlfriend and uh, her close friends. We just barbecued and hung out and uh, played some games, uh, we played some bocce ball, and a pretty cool uh, game I'm new to called Stump. Explain to me, what is Stump? I'm straight up the stump. Yo, that's a, that's a stump. Just explain the game, I'll get the footage. <laughs> you, uh, you get nails like, you know, five inch, seven inch nails, and you hammer it in into the stump like half inch. And you pretty much grab a hammer, you swing it, you catch it, and you hammer it. And you take turn doing it, and the race is to drive the, the nail into the stump where your nails can't catch it, and that person wins. And everybody else drinks. How many people can play at one time? Yeah, as many people as you want, yo. It's a pretty neat game um, to say the least but yeah we're we're excited for what today brings and everyone's just kind of getting up and getting situated right now before we head out I'm sure uh, we're gonna make good use of the time while we're up hopefully get a podcast in maybe do some sightseeing around downtown I think now mentioned something about uh, renting scooters <laughs> following each other's builds through Instagram mm -hmm. and um, through the years just enjoying um, our cars and eventually I, I came over to Calgary I think like two years ago and I wanted to meet up uh, but the uh, timeline didn't align so we made sure this time yeah 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 come say, say hi you got a pretty sweet FK8 yeah, I was hoping yeah. you were going to bring that out. Man. I know. I, I, wish, <laughs> I wish I could have. No, it's parked right now because at our new place, we can't uh, can't get into the garage. And so I have to park on the street. And yeah. There's like a bunch of construction. So I I parked it at my sister's and uh, my Mugen lip. I'm getting repainted. So it's not ready. Yeah, okay. It's not ready. No worries. <laughs> I don't want to drive it through uh, that construction. No, area. and um, before I parked it a couple weeks ago, uh, when I went out to... to get into my car I was driving and I did a shoulder check and I saw I saw handprints on the window yeah. from probably like the night before <laughs> it's like someone looking into the car I'm like nope I'm parking it I'm not, I'm not waiting I'm not taking the chance do you guys ever take the whole family out and... oh yeah yeah during the summer that's yeah. what we drive yeah. like if we're going somewhere where I know like I only drive it on roads I know yeah. like if I know that we're going somewhere where I can't get into the parking lot or whatever or yeah. there's potholes I'm like now we're not taking it today <laughs> <laughs> I, I heard you also earned it, or owned an STI as well. Mm -hmm. is that, is that 2011 STI, yeah. Oh. That one, that was like my dream car all throughout junior high and high school and in university. And I said to myself when I was, when I graduate and get my first job, I'm buying an STI. And uh, I uh, got my job and then I think that week after, I went and got the STI. Wow. And then when I bought it, I... I I put Vars kit and Voltex ring on it, and I was like, this is the most boring car ever. <laughs> and I regret it, I instantly regretted it. I was just like, oh, I don't like this car. So I, so I ended up selling it. Mm -hmm. Just the way it drove? Or I don't know modifying it, it? No, no, just like in general, like the interior, um, I'm sure you know like Subarus in general have been the same, like nothing has changed. Mm. Um, and so it was very, very boring inside. Like you got in, and it didn't feel like a driver experience. It was just like a meh, meh co cockpit, right? So I don't know. It, it got boring to get into um, real quick. So 
comparing it to uh, drivability wise to your Type R? Yeah, like the Type R, you get into it, and it's like it's an experience every single every single time. You know, <laughs> nice seats and like you know the entry, uh, uh, the welcome screen that you get and everything, and the colors. It's just a it's a treat. Whereas the SCI, you got in and it just felt like a regular car. <laughs> nothing nothing fun about it. So. I mean, the power was nice, the all-wheel drive was nice, but nice. yeah, it got old quick for some reason for me. Good morning. Um, Tony's gone off to work. So we kind of have to let ourselves out this morning, but that's cool. Um, we're just getting ready to go off on our 9.25 a.m. flight from Calgary's airport to Vancouver's to link up with Will. <sighs> so yeah, we're pretty much ready to go. Um, I just got to throw in my clothes. Everyone's kind of got their stuff ready. The kids are situated and um, yeah. They're loading up the caravan now, I think. have our ride thanks to now the Highlanders a lot smaller than the caravan but we're gonna try to Tetris the sh well, let's go Come by and do a jump. <laughs> <laughs> 